Good afternoon, lace gentlemen, I'm John, this is many a true nerd, and welcome back to Resident Evil 4. Where last time, I defeated the Verdugo without buying the rocket launcher. And honestly, I am rather proud of myself for that. And today, we've joined up with Lewis, and uh, yes, if this game is anything like the original, we might just be going on a ludicrously dumb minecart roller coaster rides. Okay, but first up, we've got what would appear to be a cave in. No TNT to clear it, and uh, whatever this is precisely. Okay, whatever it is, I'm supposed to put something on it, so I'm guessing not the box or the key. Hey, since when was this a dead end? This used to lead to the exit. Okay, so I'm guessing we need to find some dynamite to blow it the flip up. Gotcha. Oh, and speak of the devil, the dynamite's been moved to M4. So, okay. Cave-ins are frequent when you're using explosives. Uh, keep your distance in the event of disaster. Clean up immediately. Ensure adequate numbers of staff are on site. Okay, I hope two's enough, because that's all we've got. So, yeah. M4. That's what we're looking for. That's where we're going. So, alright. Let's just see what precisely is hiding in M4. Oh, bloody hell. There it is up there. I am worried about this. And hello, sexy. It's a villager! We haven't seen you guys for a while! Okay. So just a mosey on up in this direction. Looks like we've got company. What do you want to do? Alright, sounds like we've potentially got choices. We might be able to just, you know, sneak stealth, etc. We might be able to just, you know, shoot all of them in the face. That's certainly an option. Okay, hang about. Let's look at this area. I don't really want to sneak through it, to be honest, because, uh, yes, there are treasures dotted about. So, uh, me and you, Lewis, I'm sure we can handle all of this nonsense, especially as, uh, okay, we might be lacking in options aside from just vault over and a hope. So, in which case, buddy, you can just, no, you can just, oh, blimey. Okay, very good dramatic death right there. Might be able to... No, no, he's still just on fire. Still just on fire, just a bit dramatically, that's all. Right, guys, very happy to just uh, pop some heads of anybody who would like to, you know, make themselves be known to me. Just there we go, lovely. Though I'll tell you what, this feels like a waste of really good ammo. So yeah, just get out the basic uh, handgun, hop over the top. You too, Lewis, if you would be so kind. I'm probably heading in this direction these days. Uh, so, okay, Lewis, if you wouldn't mind, you know, just uh, taking them out, that would be great. I'm going to keep an eye out for snipers, but I don't see anything just yet. Also, ooh. Right, that could definitely be... I just definitely heard her. Oh, dear. Okay, slight, slight, slight miscalculation I may have made, possibly... Okay, that's fine. A few more shots in the head. Lewis, I need you to cover me while I take out the big and nasty chainsaw. Uh-oh. Okay, um, Lewis, we may have made a tactical error here. We may have made a... Okay, th there's definitely more coming. Lewis, you're about to explode and there's not much I can do about that. I'm really sorry. So how about just uh, one a grenade? You know what? Two can play at that game. That's all absolutely fine. Lewis is okay. Okay, you can just go down on the ground for a second. Uh, where is... Oh! Hang on, you go down as well. Please don't go enough ahead, thank you. Right, everything is fine. Lewis is doing good work occasionally. Okay, Lewis is... Kick! Did we get the second? We did not get the second in. I feel like he's not doing that much damage. Got that one mind, and more people coming in from behind. Okay, we're under control for the time being. No, you don't. Kickity kick. Stab, 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 stab. Thank you. There's definitely more. Oh! No, no, and... We're being a bit exploded here. There's there's a lot of them. No! Right, time to get out of... No, you don't, boy. Not having that. Not having that, having all of this mind. What happened to Chainsaw Man? Doesn't appear to be here right now, but generally those guys drop like, you know, jewels or whatnot. Oh, hang on. I think I found Chainsaw Man, or possibly Chainsaw Man number two. Whether he's actually the same one I was shooting before or not, I'm not 100% sure on that, but... I'm definitely hearing what sounds like a... 
Oh, no, that's a different one. That's a chainsaw lady. Okay, there's a chainsaw man and a chainsaw lady. Just put some bullets in them as they come on down if we are lucky. We can, yeah, finish them off without using the good ammo. All right, fine. We'll use a little bit of shotgun and then running up to the chainsaw person. Feels like a really bad idea, but as does running up to stab them, but appears to have actually worked on this occasion. And a sapphire too. And there's that guy. Right, we did take him out with the sniper. Okay, we're eating into our most supplies, but we're well under control for the time being. Okay, ultimately I want to, yeah, cross this bridge to get around to uh, the dynamite. But I don't see controls. Probably that means, yeah, looks like there's a control room up there. Just go to where the woman with the chainsaw was emerging. Loop around to where she was. Let's see what we can find in here. This has got to be right location. This looks good. This looks very good, in fact. Now I have myself to R. Hand grenades and magnum ammo. Gamey, you're feeling generous today. Right, before I do anything, I'm opening up the door just to... Oh, hang on. Hang on, we've got... We've got something going on here. Oh! No, 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 no. Oh, bloody hell. No! None of that. Thank you. Okay, they're, they're definitely coming in from behind. And they are way more obsessed with me than uh, Lewis for some reason. Just... Good little takedown there. Well done. I'll be taking the handgun ammo. Right, I think we just spawned some in behind us by reaching this room. But we're safe for the time being. Right. Hit the lever. That's presumably... Yep, there's the bridge. Now, do me and you need to do anything together? I hope not, because yes, unlike Ashley, you don't follow instructions. You're just sort of uh, following me around, uh, providing some extra firepower. So, uh, all right. Mosey on down, straight to the bridge. Uh, Grab the dynamites. It's all suspiciously slow. Which makes me think I'm supposed to be, yes, running over here before it lowers. In case it's like going to, you know, unlower once it lowers or something. So, okay. Mosey on through just in case from time of some description. Oh, blimey. No. And no. No, no, no. And kick. That was not the mel I was expecting, but excuse me. There we go. That's better. Handgun ammo. He's about to... Oh, he's about to be a thing. Don't let him. I'll use some knife condition for that. Because yeah, otherwise I'll have to use good ammo to deal with the plague ass. And you go down nice and easy. Lovely. But yeah. Basic lads here. Not too dangerous. Sorry. I thought I saw something on the left. But we are A-OK. -okay. Right. Clear the room. Grab dynamite. Back we go. Right. Dynamite. Possibly that's about to cause trouble. Nice find, my friend. But I'm not yeah, seeing anything just yet. Now, the game did say, yes, dynamite can be dangerous and you should stand well back. So we're going to put this in here. And then we're going to cocking run around the corner before we... Lewis, I'm going to suggest further away. Okay, have we just made an exit or possibly... No, that looks good. That looks Hello. good right there. Right, on we go. You sure you're just a researcher? I'm just an average guy who happens to be quite the ladies' man. All right, Lewis still being very evasive about his umbrella past. Oh, and hello, Saxon. We've got ourselves, yes, a room full of uh, steam. Right, I think I know what we're walking into right now. Dear, oh, flippin' dear. <clears throat> After you, I insist. Such a gentleman. Okay, we've got two trolls, but one of them is, yes, armoured. And that means, basically, there's not much we're going to be able to do to him. And naturally, yes, we're going to be able to dump them in the lava, but probably best if we're going to target anybody first, 
it's going to be the one who's not wearing armor and whatnot. So, okay, go over to my rifle. I just need to, yes, draw some attention to you. And if we can, just get out of the way. Okay, the armored one's going for Lewis for the time being. If I can, yeah, just basically I need to get the plag ass out. Just putting a firepower on you to do that. And uh, oh, you're about to. There we go. Right. Plagus is out already. Just need to bring you down on this thing. Then that's going to be the controls, I assume. So don't mind me. That's a good hit right there. He goes down on the... Oh, blimey. Lewis, you're in the way. Sorry about this. Just uh, get on here. Right. Lewis is keeping one of them busy. Lewis probably can't die. He's needed for the plot. So uh, we'll just be taking you out for the time being. But yes, what we really need is a dropping him in the lava. So I need you, buddy, in more of uh, this direction. So just, uh, yeah, a few more shots in the head. Come on, just a bit more. And... Okay, he just fell backwards in the cutscene, actually. Is he dead, dead? And... Oh, blimey, I, I don't know. The camera's not cooperating right now. And just tell myself to... No, he's actually proper dead. Okay. So, uh, he was definitely, yes, yeah, significantly less tough than the ones we've run into previously. Though, possibly, yes, my rifle's just a lot better than it was. Uh, we need to stagger this guy. Presumably, though, actually, you know what? Just get him moving towards me. Okay, wait, wait, and... Oh, blimey! He's got a jump attack. That's, that's new. That's, that's interesting. Okay, Lewis... Keep him busy while I just, uh, yes, do a bit of uh, looting around. Uh, sorry, keep up. Okay, Lewis is just naffed off somewhere. Brilliant. Um, okay. This is fine. Uh, Lewis has hopefully got a plan because... Okay, I might be able to do something if I target precisely the right bit of the head. Like, say, the... Oh, blimey. Ow. Okay, everything's... Everything's fine, apart from the fact he's trying to grab me. We're swimming in health items right now. That's okay, just... Oh! Over here. Okay, what are you... What are you trying to do? Oh, you want me to bring him over there? Okay. I'm doing it. Have you got a plan precisely? Cause... Okay, just any time you... I'm stuck on the previous corpse. And... Bloody Hero Lewis. And now we need to shoot that. Okay. And oh, blimey, 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 blimey. Oh! Okay, he just slightly hit me. It's, it's, it's fine. We'll get to that in just a second. Uh, just need to reload my rifle. I need somebody to draw his attention to be around the back of him. And if possible, just go over to this and just go. Is that going to be good enough? I mean, it's good enough to get the Plagas out, so, yep, go into melee. My knife is always going to be the best option when it's available. Question is, how many times can we do this? Or now the Plagas is out, now can we take him out conventionally? Because that might be the case. Okay, go over to you. Got plenty of this. Okay, we've got plenty of... Oh, he just picked the wrong moment to turn. I need him to, yes, pay attention to that. Or, now it could be time for lava. No! Ow! That was the wrong time to try and turn around. Straight between the legs. Straight between the legs. Straight between the legs. Uh, I need to bring him down. So, yeah. A good plague-ass hit would do the job. And by any chance this is going to be... Can we just get him to be still about here? Hold. Hold. And screw you, buddy. Okay. I think that actually went pretty smooth. And there we go. Giants defeated. One by hand, so I did get a diamond, though. Possibly, yeah, I missed another reward by uh, dumping him. But still, I'd say that worked out pretty smooth. Oh, yeah. I, think we can get here. I will be with you in a second. I'm just looting. They're keeping those things cooped up down here, too? The underground here is sacred to them. See, this is where they discovered Las Plagas. Preserved inside ancient deposits of Ember. Of course they did. Okay, hence the mention of uh, Amber to Ada earlier. Lovely. And one more reward too. We have got ourselves... Uh, okay, basic pendant. Nothing to plug into that, unfortunately. Yeah, I think I'm still missing the gems I need, actually. 
Actually, you know what? I could now do, yeah, thanks to the green, a duo, and triple bonus. That's a 1.8, and yes, I know I could do, uh, yes, the double yellow diamond, which would be worth more, but I'd rather keep a good spread for future treasures. So, if I don't come across an Alexandrite before the next merchant, I'll probably be happy to sell the crown like this, because that's a good amount of money. Right, in which case, keep on keeping on, and let's see what we've got next. Oh, I'm picking up on, yeah, what Lewis was saying. Right here. Ruins. So I suspect we're gonna get, yes, wild plagas. Little spidery lads floating around in this bit of the world. So, uh, yeah. I'd say SMG, good pick for them. They're fast, but they're not actually very strong when they don't have a host. So, uh, oh no. I just got that completely wrong. Okay. It would appear... We're going for a ride, actually. Ah, oh, life is good. So, okay, me and Lewis are going for a lovely roller coaster. Oh, this is going to be marvelous. Just get her going. It's moving. This should speed things up a bit. I can't believe I'm doing this. Hey, we're in a hurry, right? Oh, by the way. What now? Hope you like thrill rides. Okay, it's literally a roller coaster. I've also got infinite ammo for a red nine. I didn't have a minute to go, but I guess, like, you know, it's just a. Uh, oh, blimey. Hang on, we need to. We need to be leaning, apparently. Lean, like, into the corners, presumably, right? Okay, so we need to do uh, leaning, and if need be, shooting, and just about got away with that. Change all of the bits and pieces. Oh, this is. This is marvellous and also nonsense. Oh, this is brilliant. They've made this stupider than the original. So just prepare. We're going to have trouble coming in. Watch out for... Yes, lovely bits and pieces here. Get the cart back on. No! No, 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 no. None of that for you also. None of... Excuse me, leave my cart alone. Ah, no, no. Where did you just come from? Okay, go! Missed! And then, okay, the card has a health bar, which is hilarious, and we're already, never mind, we're already mostly a bit on the dead side. This is, this has not been a good start. I feel like, uh, yes, this is, this is not God's plan. Actually, fix that. There we go. Just lean in if we have to. And, what are we? Okay, we're literally just jumping over bits and pieces. This is, no, that's, uh-oh. No, no. Okay, managed to... Never mind, I should have used the explosives and... No, 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 no. Missed literally everything there. Luckily, so did, uh, so did... Okay, that bit's a bit on the tricky side, actually. You've got to really nail those guys. I mean, just out of interest, no, I can't go over to a different gun. This is just straight up an on-rails bit. I've just got to do this, uh, yes, however the game wants me to do it, which is uh, with the red nine, apparently. So, uh, okay, prepare to do things. Uh, break that, and then flick you. Lovely. Reload nice and fast. Okay. All nice and simple, but yeah, you've absolutely got to nail the shots against the people coming in, which is tricky because this is not the most accurate gun in the world. Like, the Red Nine's got a bit of spread on her, damn it. So uh, that was honestly just basically luck right there. And dear, oh, flipping dear. Right. Yeah, you've got to, like, give it a moment to get hooked in. And even then might not do the job. And the, yeah, thing is not that great either. Oh, blimey. Okay, this is... This bit's tough, actually. This used to just be a bit of a joke section, to be honest, but this is nasty. Okay, back to the ludicrous jump section. We've now got to, yes, make sure we hit everybody. And there is, okay, there's also the lovely red section right there. Just start, uh, yes, firing at random. Yeah, there's explosives up ahead. I could use the red barrels. That's, that's what I meant by that. No, no. And then, no, no, you were planning to light explosives, weren't you? I bet you flipping were as well. Right, just keep on keeping on. There's got to be more coming in. No, 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 no. There we go. That all worked out more or less. Okay, everything's going... Uh oh No, why would you have that in your cart right now? And just reset that, just so we're rechanging everything. At one point, there's going to be a troll one where you're not supposed to actually push it, isn't there? That's going to be hilarious when it comes up. So, okay, we're doing well. Hopefully, there's like a checkpoint at some point or another. So, 
keep on keeping on. Prepare for trouble. And we might have made it. Beautiful. At least through, uh, yeah, stage one. This it? Afraid not. Things are just getting started. Oh, I'm delighted to hear it. Oh, yeah. This is literally called the stopover. So, uh, right. That is... Okay. I like that this is actually properly mapped out. That's lovely. And I can hear something around here. We are not alone in the stopover. Someone's definitely... Yep. I hear someone around here. So, okay. You don't have, like, a dynamite or anything. You're fine. Buddy, no trouble with you. And we just need a good... Stop diving from side to side. That's... Ow! Well, that was bloody rude of you. Okay, could have done with a bit more uh, fire support there. Uh, if you'd be so kind, Lewis. There we go. For some reason, this guy's the toughest bastard who ever lived. Uh, no. No heads for you. Also, that was a really fancy... Uh-oh. Lewis, run! Sorry, Lewis. Right, we've definitely got dynamite people around. And hang about, hang about, hang about. Lovely. Always enjoy doing that. It's okay, just a mosey on in. Dynamite throw has been taken care of. It should be one treasure in this area. I think we're done. Okay, for some reason, yes, that one guy was causing me a lot of trouble. For basically, yes, no good reason whatsoever, actually. There's another thing we can uh, stick some gems into. Lovely. And I'm also hearing a hangabout. There we are. You, buddy. The clockwork laddie. Though I've definitely missed, like, several of you. Because I've only got, like... Four at the moment, and uh, yes, I'm in chapter 11. So, okay, we're not getting that achievement. And yeah, my new little thingy right here, once again, it's only two, so uh, duo's best thing we can do. Honestly, just fill it full of sapphires. I'm swimming in sapphires. Okay, my body armor's, yeah, almost trash, but actually that barely even matters, because yeah, at this point, we're just gonna be using Luisa's Red 9 for some reason. Okay, Operation Incredibly right. Stupid Dumb Section let's Part 2. Let's oh. cocky go. Alright, here we go. Hop in. And be ready for, yeah, signs, droppy things, people on those balconies, etc, etc. Okay, just prepare for trouble. Lean until the cart's fine. There we go. We're all under control for now. So, okay. Three of them in a row. Then this nonsense cocky. What the actual cock? What the actual cock is happening right now? And no. That should take care of you, right? And Okay. A chainsaw person is just napping off over there. What the actual flip is happening? Just, just randomly fire because it's not like the red nine's gonna you know what i'm gonna call that a huge win i have no idea how that went so well possibly the game's being generous you're about to light a thing aren't you not anymore you're not right reload seems like a good moment what happened to the chainsaw guy oh lewis is having a lovely time i appreciate this hugely okay and no 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 no, no. well that wasn't my fault you didn't let me bloody shoot the gun so okay this is this is all fine and any... No, no, the other way, other way, other way, other way. We're outside. That seems like good news. How are we still going, by the way? Because we're going uphill. Momentum doesn't work this way. But all right, fine. What have you? Just keep on keeping on. And I see that. Open up a path for us. Reload straight through the flames. Obviously, that doesn't hurt in the slightest. Okay. Where's Chainsaw Man? Chainsaw Man's gonna be... I knew you'd be back somewhere. Okay, you know what? Just go for him. Just go for him. Take out the cart if need be. Come on, come on, come on. And we are... Should we be prioritizing? Oh, we should not be prioritizing. No, 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 no. Honestly, I'm very proud of my shooting right now. And uh oh, no. No, 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 no. Leave my cart alone. This is catastrophically dumb and I love it. Okay, no. No, 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 no. You're still over there, but you're a long way away. What the cock is... Oh, you're back, are you? Okay, that's fine. Just, uh... Uh-oh, this is a bad time to reload. This is a really bad time to reload! Sorry! Just a few more in the head. Red 9 is powerful. Like, Red 9 can take this guy out. Eventually, reload. Off he goes again. This is the dumbest thing in this game so far. It's even dumber than the original. And I admire that. I admire the fact that... Uh-oh. 
There we go. I admire the fact that they've made it even dumber. That the people making this game fully 100% acknowledged that it was a dumb game full of dumb stuff and that's why it was fun. And not only have they kept the dumb stuff, they've made it dumber. And all right, I suspect we've got, uh, yes, Novista doors coming in, given the bugs. Ahead. This isn't even the first time we've jumped off a thing, but okay, fine. Apparently this time it's a problem. What? <laughs> Are you serious? Jump! <laughs> oh yeah! Luis, can I get a hand? Give us a three to one next time, yes, Sancho? Uh, whatever. And naturally, jumping out of the cart actually didn't hurt either of us in any meaningful way. Lovely. No way. Give me a break. We can make it if we circle around. Come on. Okay, that lift is apparently the destination, but it's not the way we're getting immediately. No, now we need to loop all the way around, which honestly I was just kind of assuming we'd have to do. Like, this doesn't even bother me. So, okay, just keep on keeping on. Let's see what we flipping got. Because it's probably, as I say, invisible murder bugs. They're going to be popping up from below. Because you don't have a hive without bugs. And, oh... That's one of them in the dormant form. Wants that. Oh, I think they're coming in as well. Oh, bl oh blimey, blimey, blimey. Lewis, you could have shot that one. I feel like that, that was on you. Okay, they're also invisibles. I don't know if they can fly while they're invisible, though. I'm not sure if that's a... No. And no. No. Down you go. Okay, just on occasion, eyes open around this area. Because, if possible... Oh, they might just be spawning. Forever. Keep an eye open. Are they just going to keep coming? Because if they are, then I should not be wasting ammo. I should just uh, run and... Oh, they're just coming forever. Right, okay, cool. Cool, cool, cool. Right, run and gun. That changes the arithmetic. Like, a lot. So, right, just get over here. Take them out. Grab everything we can. Smash and cocking grab. What is this? And, uh, okay. Destroy entrances to the hive. Uh, okay. That would logically stop them respawning. So, okay. By the looks of it, yes. If I was to go up towards the left here. Can I take out... Oh, blimey. No, 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 no. Is that an entrance to the hive? Just take that out. Yep, it is. Good. So, in which case, does that now stop spawning? Because presumably... Okay, there's one the other side, unfortunately. So there's not much I can do about that one. Well, not from this angle. I might be able to do something from this angle. Loop back around. Okay, we now know what we're doing. I can now see... Yep, yeah, I can see you. Right there. One. Two. Lovely. Right. And you into the pit. You also into the pit. No more of... Okay, he did burst. Everything's fine. Okay. Two down. We're looking for wibbly things and we're looking for, yeah, like jiggly tentacles. That looks like one over there. Can I maybe hit that from this side? I want a 100% can depending on hitboxes. So go. Alright, three out of four. One more to go. Where's the wibbling? Don't see it, but honestly, even if it weren't for the shiny things, this would be worth doing just to, yes, stop the endless supply of new enemies. Okay, guns out. Watch out for the eyes. The ones on the ground that are ambushing me are probably invisible. Oh. Hang on. I don't know if that's one or not. I don't think it is. Okay, just prepare and... Oh. I see you. You're about to explode. Good. Good, good. I maybe should have saved that, actually. For, like, you know, when more bugs show up in a few seconds. It's okay. Just keep picking up bits and pieces. Oh! Oh, blimey! Ow! 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 No! Bad bug! Bad bug! Bad bug! 
None of that for you. Go. Finish you off. Is he dead? He's dead. Okay. That was another... That's just a rock. I need to find the last wibbly bit. Are you the wibbly bit? You are not the wibbly bit. That was the wibbly bit, John. That was very obvious, actually. Two. Done. Okay. That should be no more spawning in. Good. I'll take that. That's worth it. Yeah, there's a really nasty section in the original game where you're running around a cave not dissimilar to this, trying to plug things into other things to escape, which I assume this is like a, uh, a reference to. But this actually seems, uh, yeah, way more under control than that section was. Not only to suggest I've got Lewis to help me on this occasion. And yeah, just be alert for the, yeah, ones that are paralyzed or in stone or whatnot. Two good pistol shots will finish them off, which honestly is, uh, yeah, pretty manageable. I am concerned that the game slaps down this. Right, okay. Around the corner. Around the corner, around the corner. Right, that's you nice and exploded. Lovely. Thank you very, very much indeed. Right, round down here. Help myself to bits and pieces. We're actually... Oh, blimey. Okay, my inventory's got out of hand. Give me a second. Oh, yeah, we can fix this by just uh, blending uh, some uh, herbs together. No problem whatsoever. There we go. Still a bit of a mess, but you know what? I will happily take that because... Uh, yeah, submachine gun or rifle. Honestly, take rifle. Like, never don't take rifle. A rifle is just inherently very good. And uh, give me some hands, Garner. That's not gonna hurt. And yeah, it's so cheap these days thanks to the teddy bear charm. Right, side room here. Very dark side room. Oh, I do not trust this. Oh, I don't like this. Not one little bit. Okay, gold bar. Lewis, I think we're about to be ambushed. Alright. Not yet, but I don't trust any of this nonsense. Right, just keep on keeping on. Yeah, the hive has been disabled. Uh, we're more than a halfway around the room. We're actually doing uh, pretty well for the time being. And yeah, seriously, stick to uh, SMG. SMGs. No! Off you go. Straight off. Straight. Cocking. Oh, no. You can just drop two. Yeah, just drop them before they get over land. That way... They're in trouble. But then again, this does mean I get the reward. So I will not say no to the reward because they will drop something. And gunpowder is uh, common and really bloody good. Seriously, that was almost enough for, yeah, a fresh set of handgun ammo right there. Okay, we're almost there. But there's also, yeah, one side room. <laughs> and it's a merchant room too. Okay. Well, that there, that's marvelously good news. So, four shiny things are for dealing with the hive, are literally just outside. And, yeah, pendant can go, gold barn can go, various velvet blues can go, this is fine. I've still not found, yeah, a single bit of the purple rectangle, so I will sell the crown, toss in, yeah, one, a boot knife that we don't actually need, and I think we are, yep, that's fine. Okay, step one, repair the knife, repair the body armor. That is just so bloody useful. And then I am tempted to basically just make a run at the shotgun being max condition. That does tempt me a lot, given it's already pretty well developed. Yeah, I'm doing that. So, okay, max out the power. Then give it a bit of reload speed to give it some ammo capacity. We're not going to maybe get right up to exclusive, but we're going to get bloody close. And you know what? I'll take a little bit more of this. Bit more of this too. Oh, we're going to get really close, actually. I love it. So, okay. Ammo capacity up to 12. Uh, we're probably about, yeah, I'm 7 shy. Then it'll be maybe 16. So, uh, okay, like 23,000 away from unlocking the exclusive. Beautiful. He is also selling resources, so hang on, John. Before you buy any of that, slap on my cheap resources thingy just for a second. Because you know what? I've got the change and I've got plenty of flipping gunpowder coming in. So, yeah. Buy myself at some lovely cheap resources. 
Then we just slip the teddy bear back on again. Lovely. And now we can start crafting submachine gun so, so bloody quick and easy. Right, speaking of which, back to submachine gun. And now let's get back above ground. And yes, this should bring me very nearby to... Oh yes, the... Uh, the Doom Tower. I kind of forgot we were getting nearby to the Doom Tower, but yes, if we've done the minecart and we're going up above ground, then we're getting very nearby to Salazar's Doom Tower. Phew. I'm beat. Makes you appreciate tech like this. I don't get you. Why risk your life like this? You don't know us. I told you. It makes me feel better. Be straight with me for once. Los Illuminados. I was working for that. See, there you go. Helping the two of you doesn't make up for it. I know that. But still, I don't want anyone else to get hurt. In that case, you better get serious. <laughs> Harsh words for a squire. You know, I did just realize. I'm like 90% sure you'd already died at this point in the original. We're out of that hell. The fresh air is calling our names. Por fin. Gus, if we made it all this way, you know it means we're almost... <coughs> almost what? <coughs> I was wondering why you were still alive. Louis! Long time no see, rookie. Major Krauser? What the hell? Why? Recovering stolen goods. And killing a few rats along the way. Easy work. Ashley, it was oh, you. You catch on quick. Didn't I teach you? Knives are faster. Not good. Oh, this is an actual fight. Oh, that's that's a problem. Oh, that's that's an issue. Okay, this used to just be quick time events in the original. All right, prepare and then go for yeah, very fast. Stab! Oh, blimey! Okay, I need to get better at the uh yes. Oh yeah, the flipping, parrying and whatnot, which I have been completely ignoring. I just got the knife basics achievement on Steam. Oh, that's a good sign. That's that's a good sign right there. That I've not been doing uh, enough of this. I've not been practicing at. Go! And then I could go for the melee. Okay, it's that. And then get one more swing in if I'm lucky. Why would you work for these freaks? Have you forgotten what happened to me? Operation Javier. Oh. Operation Javier. Okay, one, I have no idea what Operation Javier is. And two, this is not actually going that well. So what I'm going to try and do is... Oh, blimey. Okay, I, I've just been slightly... Sorry, sorry, stab him in the leg. Just been a little bit, little bit. Can I just go over two? I can't use any other weapons. Oh, great. Go! And then... Okay, just go for the counters. Just wait for the counters. Go! And then go for this. And break free. Kick him. Trying to see if we can get a couple of follow-up... Swings in. Evade. Follow up. Swing. Oh, hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. He's doing something. Okay, that's fine. And swing. No, evade that. Okay, cool. And he's coming for the swing. Oh. And then go for the melee. We're doing okay so far. This is going. And then follow up with a couple of sweeps. Okay. This is fine. No. Oh, what was that? What was. Oh, what was that? What was that? Oh, what was that? He's going for so many attacks. Follow attack. I'm, oh, 
Watch out. He's trying to get behind me. Fine, he's doing little leaps. And then... No! Okay. No, block! Oh, cock me. I've not been doing enough knife preparation for this. And then avoid. Get around the back of you. Oh! Evade and break free. I am almost dead. This is... This is a nasty little fight all of a sudden. Okay, this is... You know what? Give myself a bit more health. I'll keep me going. Wish I could just pull out a shotgun. That would be great. Go for a couple of attacks. Miss my melee there. Go, go, go. And then follow. Okay. My knife is not in great condition. No, no. And then... Oh, ow. I went for the, the counter, not the evade. Should have gone for the evade. Oh, he is eating my health. He's eating my... Oh, excuse me. No, no, no. Did he just toss his knife at me? No, he's got it back. Oh, this is a problem, actually. Enough play, rookie. You haven't changed a damn bit. <laughs> what a disappointment. <laughs> to the ladies of the world. Don't talk. Take this. The key to my laboratory. Go there and remove those damn parasites. <coughs> Help Ashley. So, fun fact, in the original, that was not Lewis who did that. He'd already died in the castle just from being stabbed in the back again, but by Lord Sadler, not by Krauser, who hadn't been introduced at that point in the story. Instead, the person who, yes, shoots the gun and saves you is actually Ada, who just sort of didn't do it on this occasion because Lewis got to have the big hero moment instead. So, okay, fascinating rewrite there. I'm glad I remembered Lewis was supposed to be dead literally moments before he died. Marvellous. Yes, apparently that was the first time in the entire game I bothered parrying an enemy with a knife. So, um, right, I should definitely do some practice with the knife. Because, uh, yeah, I suspect when we run into Krauser again, we're going to need to do the same thing again. You were a fine knight, Don Quixote. You won't get away with this, Krauser. Alright, we got the key, and presumably, yes, we are nearby to the surface. Hopefully, anyway, we've been underground for a bloody while. Oh, and good news, I think the game is, yes, acknowledging that that was a fairly tough fight in terms of uh, how fast Krauser can drain your health bar, because uh, we are swimming in herbs on this platform. Lovely. Leon, there's only time to say this once, so listen up. They took your friend to the top of the clock tower. If you hurry, you might get there before she turns into one of them. Ah, uh, so you aren't heartless after all. I guess I should be thankful? Yeah, you should. Alright, so we are now back above ground and... Uh, I know precisely where we are. I've seen this. So, okay. Crack this open. This is back to, yeah, where we were ages ago. The hallway where we ran into the Novista doors for the first time. Maybe don't go back inside in case they've decided to uh, respawn or whatnot. Got yet another merchant right here too, though. Oh, bloody hell. Right, that might be too many optional submissions. So, okay. Stolen jewel, a thieving crow. Found in the vile thing's nest. Sell a scratched emerald in the courtyards. 
Okay, fascinating. And number two, deface Ramon's portrait. So, okay, I think that's... That's the room I was in, yeah, just a while ago. Like, the room I was uh, dumped down out of. So, yeah, if I went back there now, presumably it would no longer be with him in it. So, okay. Two missions that aren't just, hey, break the blue thing. So that makes me a bit more interested. Okay, here we go. So, yeah, if I take a one direction out of the ballroom, I can make it back to the courtyard for the crow nice and easy. Yeah, the throne room's actually much easier. And now he's not there, I can get the treasure. Lovely. Just, chat. be alert to the possibility the enemies are all going to have respawned. Because, you know, bugs, infestation, nest, etc, etc. Kind of feels like a thing they would do. But... I don't hear anything just yet. Good starts. Ooh, slight issues of mine. Slight issues, which is we appear to have... Right, we've got, we've got some... No! No, 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 no. Ow! Okay, I'm being attacked by the hyper guys. Okay, this is... Right, there, there were people. There were people here. As it turns out, just top up my health. Nice and fast. Stick with shotgun. Loop around the outside. Uh, see if we can just, yeah, funnel them in right to the... Oh, John, you can't outrun these guys. Not a chance can you outrun these bastards. So, can we just get straight through here and... Apparently so. Good, 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 good. Guys, none of that. None of that. If you'd be so kind to take out the little bugger. No, 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 no. Okay, fine. They managed to find someone else to latch on to. That's a bit of a shame. Right, you need to just... Would someone please die? No. None of that. Right, you're dead. And you, buddy, need to go down... Hold still for a second. Lovely. Right, that's you all lovely and dead. Right, where are they gone? They might possibly be out of host, which would be great news, because then they're cocking useless. And... Oh, no, they found one. They found one. Right. No. Bye. And then just take out Mr. Host. Oh, this is... Why is this harder than it should be? This should not be this... Ow. Stab it. Okay, never mind. He stabbed me first. Okay, just get some... Why am I here right now? Okay, I think I'm invincible while I'm opening doors, which is brilliantly good news. Okay, stop it. Stop hooking on to people. Just die. There we go. One of them's dead at least. To be clear, all of this nonsense was done because the game wants me to find a way to deface the portrait of this chappy. So, okay, I can't help but notice you've left chickens in the throne room, which I think I know precisely what I'm supposed to be doing. Right, equip egg, which is a thing you're allowed to do, and... Oh, yeah. I have disgraced you. Beautiful. I've also decided I'm going to... Oh, yeah. Sit on your chair and just look fancy for no well-explained reason. Now, I'm pretty sure I saw... Yes, another treasure in here. So... Oh, no. Not a treasure. A note. Master Ramon, with tomorrow's procedure, I shall finally surpass the limitations of this mortal shell. What's left of me now shall soon be gone. Magnificent, the holy body is a wondrous miracle. Okay, he did have, yeah, two verdugos with him. This might be the other one. Here we go. This is what we needed for the other treasure. So we just need to do the little puzzle box thing. That looks about right. Marvellous. Crack you open and... Okay, so I'll be taking this. The chickens aren't just here so that you know there's a reason to egg his portrait. He's also like just really into chickens because one of them laid a golden egg one time and um as a result he put that away and kept the chickens here in case they ever did it again. So Okay, strange room as it turns out. And one ornate necklace that is yeah, four slots. So okay. Back the way we came, we're now going to, yeah, the far side. Back to the courtyard, where apparently there is, a, yes, like, a crow that's stolen an emerald or something. Here we go, I need to find, yes, a nest. Just find a nest, shoot it, it will drop out of the nest and bring it back. So, yeah, things in nest, that exists in all. Well, I see a crow. It may or may not be... The thieving crow, but... Oh, bloody hell. Right, well, you guys are back, are ya? No, no, no. Never mind. That's better. Right. Everything's fine. I 
Aside from the fact that, um, yes, there's... thought I saw something move, but it's fine. Okay. There is apparently a nest somewhere in this very large, very overgrown, very complicated... Are you alive? Not 100% sure how you survived being shot at a minute ago, but sure. And there's... What the cock is happening? Are you just consistently getting back up again? I'm going to keep my eye on you. Okay, just look away. What the actual cock is happening? Okay, just turn around. And turn back. I've decided to join a fight with this crow. This crow is possibly stronger than me. Also, hang on. What is what is that? What is that? It's a statue. It's fine. Okay. How am I supposed to find the crow's nest in an area where it could be cocking anywhere? Oh, bloody hell. I just spent a lot of time exploring the cocking maze and scanning the rooftops with, uh, yes, my rifle. And I now know why that crow wouldn't die. It's because you're just supposed to disturb it and then it will lead you to the nest, which isn't in the actual courtyard maze. It's just sort of, uh, yes, nearby to it by the merchant. So, uh, bloody hell. Ryan, right, speak nice. of the devil. We've got the merchant right here. So, uh, multiple uh, shiny Will. things, if you'd be so kind. Uh, then just, yeah, sell the scratched emerald. Uh, get the money. And on top of that, I get the shiny things too. Though hilariously, yes, my combat knife is in terrible condition, as is my armor. So, uh, despite everything I've just done, yes, I basically banked down to zero money again. Okay, I'm not having this. I want my shotgun to be at its maximum level, and uh, I do happen to be only just around the corner from, uh, yeah, the battlements, where we are just swimming in potential treasures I've apparently missed. So, okay, one of these has got to be, yes, a lovely gem I could put into my crown. Although, possibly, we are going to have some problems with, uh, yes, some new uh, locals uh, who have shown up since, like some of the Knights of Armour, have now sort of uh, woken up a little bit. But, against my shotgun, they're not doing so hot, but a chance. No, that's a shiny thing, dear, oh, flipping dear. Right, there's... Right, that's why we didn't get that one previously. Because, okay, bloody Lewis. Where's Lewis when we need him? Okay, back to, yes, the battlements. If we're lucky, this at least will not have any terrifying surprises. Never mind, I can literally already see the terrifying surprises. Good, 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 good. But apparently I missed a treasure in here. So let's not worry too much about the terrifying surprises. There's, a, there's only one monk. One monk is not so bad, all things considered. Just give him a good kick. Give him a good... Dab, give me some gunpowder. Honestly, one bullet for three gunpowder. That's a great deal. Oh, I see. When I was racing around trying to not be, yes, hit by giant rocks, I missed that there was just a ladder in this area. Right, that's what I missed last time I was passing by. Gotcha. So, okay, just sneak around. Might be able to, uh knife someone in the back. Honestly, actually, that's probably a bad idea. Like, knife in the back means I need to repair my knife. That costs me money. This is just like one bullet and you're done, buddy. That's way better. Oh, yeah. Now this. This was worth coming back for. One, gunpowder. Two, money. Three, even more bits of money. Four, yellow herb. And five, whatever the cock this is. Emeralds. That is precisely what I needed. Because now we can go one green, and one red, and one blue, and finally, the yellow. So four colour bonus, that is, that's as good as it gets for fours, right? Yeah, that is better than two duos, so, okay. That's now as good as it can be at 57,000. We can now sell that immediately, and finally get the shotgun up to maximum condition. So I see you down there, you stupid bastards. Okay, they're trying to get on top of me right now, but they're also holding shields, like, in front of them while trying to climb a ladder that I'm at the top of. So, I mean, guys, I feel like this is not, not gonna work for you. I mean, feel free to give it a go, but I'm not feeling good about your chances. Also, I think I just found, yes, the lovely tiny Salazar that I missed previously. So, okay, we've de-missed one of those. Okay, valuables and ornate necklace. Lovely. So, okay. 
That's some good money. Do not forget to, yes, fix up the knife and the armor as the priority. That's always got to be what you do first. And then, reload. Reload again. Okay. Either 80 grand or one ticket. Which, irritatingly, I am very nearby to. But on the other hand, all I need to do is find a one rat back in the Great Hall and I can just get the ticket. Then I don't need to pay for the upgrades. There he is. I've got the bastard. He was actually on his way to the armory. Okay, good sir. I will take one exclusive upgrade ticket. And yeah, by the looks of it, the way it works is if you want to pay for it, it's got to be fully upgraded. If you've got the ticket with the shinies, you can just do it anyway. So basically, yes, I've done this the least possible efficient way, which does make me think. I mean, I should just, you know, use the ticket on something else. That way I could just spend the money to make this thing do its job. Okay, here's what we're going to do. I've got enough stuff on me to, yes, get up to the amount of money I want because... Uh, I am never going to use the assault rifle. Alright, I just like the stingray so much more. So you get salt. That's 50,000. I can buy it back from him if I decide to change my mind later. Then we just sell, yeah, gold chicken egg together with, yeah, a handful of sapphires because I am swimming in sapphires. I do not need all of these. Sell that. That's 72,000. Two more. That gets me to 80,000. I'm gonna do it. Sapphires seem to be coming out of everywhere right now. And that means we're going to, yeah, give the power upgrade uh, to the black tail. And the shotgun, that gets upgraded uh, with the money. So, uh, okay. 12.8 times 1.5. Uh, this thing, 1.9 times 1.5, uh, meaning next time I've got money and I do not have money anymore. Bloody hell. Uh, yeah, we want to get the power moving in the right direction because every increase is now being multiplied. Lovely. So, okay, we're back over here, and now I've got an arsenal that is ready to do a lot more damage, especially the shotgun. All the power of the striker, but with the added benefit of it, yeah, pretty decent accuracy, even at medium range. We are bloody ready. And we'd better be because, yes, waiting right over the ravine is the clock tower, and... Uh, I know precisely what that's gonna mean. Seriously, just looking at the map, I can see it all already. This is going to be the precise same Nightmare Madness sequence as in the original. We're gonna have to fight our way up the tower and every step is going to be a menace, leading inevitably, because they're never gonna have cut this out, to the elevator sequence, where yes, the world's slowest and most fragile elevator takes you inch by agonizing an inch to the top of this bloody huge tower. So I suspect me and Mr. Shotgun have got our work cut out for us, and once that's done, it's time for the showdown against Salazar, and then straight on to the island. So okay, lots of stuff happening next episode, hopefully you join me for that. But in the meantime, I've been John, this has been many a true nerd. And this has been Resident Evil 4. Thank you very much, and goodbye. Wait, wait, and flamethrower! 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 Okay, so this is... This is definitely morally questionable. The point where you start singing the flamethrower song, potentially, you've gone over the line.